Prosecutors are fighting back against efforts to move the trial of two former Minneapolis officers accused in George Floyd's murder out of the city. The state trial for Tu Tau and J. Alexander King is scheduled to begin in less than two weeks. Both are charged with aiding and abetting Floyd's murder. As Esme Murphy reports, prosecutors argue there is no place the trial could be moved to where potential jurors had not heard about the case. Jury selection in the trial of J. Alexander King and Tu Tau begins here in Hennepin County Court on June 13th. This would be trial number three in the George Floyd case. Derek Chauvin was convicted of murder in 2021. Earlier this year, King, Tao, and Lane were found guilty in federal court of depriving Floyd of his civil rights. If convicted here in state court, these two other officers could face 12 and a half years in prison. The trial also comes after Brooklyn Center police officer Kim Potter was found guilty of manslaughter in the death of Dante Wright. For defense attorneys, it's a seismic shift from when juries would give police officers the benefit of the doubt. Joe Tamarino is a defense attorney not affiliated with this case. In the last year, uh, the political climate, the social climate has not been good for officers who are facing criminal charges. Another likely factor in this case is witness fatigue. I'm going to have to testify again. Courtney Ross, George Floyd's girlfriend, says testifying again is overwhelming, not just for her, but the other witnesses, too. All of them are just so traumatized. They are having a hard time moving on in life. The defense in this case has filed a motion to move the trial to either Dakota or Olmstead counties because of pretrial publicity. A similar motion in Derek Chauvin's case failed, and the prosecution is once again arguing that moving the trial wouldn't matter because the pretrial publicity has affected every part of the state. In Minneapolis, as May Murphy, WCCO 4 News. Thomas Lane is the other officer who helped to hold George Floyd down. He has pleaded guilty to aiding and abetting murder and agreed to a three-year sentence. Derek Chauvin is currently serving 22 and a half years in prison following his murder conviction.